the end of the year? Well, it's in a couple of parts because between Christmas and New Year's, we get very busy. But first, my daughter Ellie turned 15 years old and she wanted to go see the Roosevelt Hotel in all of its glory. Watch this. I come to this hotel a lot because of weddings and commercial events and all. It's a beautiful, beautiful hotel. Then I had the last wedding of 2019 and my second shooter was this guy, Titus. He's awesome. This is the last wedding of the year, but also of the decade. And I couldn't have done it without my boy, Titus. Hello. <laughs> this is Titus. If you think I'm cool and crazy, you haven't met Titus yet, man. This, this guy is a stinking paratrooper that doesn't take you know what from anybody. Mama Mia, Mama Mia. Mama Mia, let me go. We know how to get the shot. He knows how to get the shot. And it just makes my life so much easier. You heard? That's right, that's right. Is it? Hey, then I was commissioned to help photograph the Sugar Bowl, which is tomorrow on New Year's Day with my buddy, Mr. Wally Porter. He uh, was actually the first photographer that ever gave me a job 27 years ago. That's awesome. Then I had a maternity session from a past bride of mine. Look at these amazing images. It was absolutely pretty nasty of a day. Honestly, it was sprinkly rainy. It was very overcast. And honestly, it was perfect. Lighting was even. The water made the ground glisten. Everything green, got greener. It's like all the foliage and plants and trees like woke up. I love it. All right, all right, all right. We're working on our party for New Year's Eve. This has been a thing of ours for the last like 10 years because I'd rather my kids here with a fireworks show at the end of the night instead of leaving downtown being out with all the crazies, if you know what I mean. The only thing I want to tell you guys, and I mean it sincerely, going into 2020, this is the end of a decade, which means change. And if there's one thing for me that's been very obvious is how important it is for you to understand that nobody else is responsible for your success. Somebody may open a door for you. You may go to college and get a degree. Nobody owes you anything. Even after getting your degree, nobody owes you anything because you still have to do a good job, be a good person, wash, rinse, and repeat. You have to grind no matter how you decide on your career. Whether you're like me and you love your job, there's still a grind. There's still a lot of work to what I have to do. You hear this fireworks? All right. So I want you to understand that 2020 is all about you. I don't care how old you are. I don't care what career you want to go into. Just know that this is your year, man. This is change. It's the end of the decade. You got no excuse, man. Here comes the biggest reset button of your life. What you choose to do with it is all up to you, you know? So look, I want to thank you guys so very much. This has really honestly been a journey for me and I appreciate you being on board. Um, you know, I got a lot of you subscribers that are really good at leaving me comments and sharing some love, especially my buddy Rob over with Throttle Down Under. He's in Australia. Pirate Pete, uh, Sonny Greenwich. Come on, man. I can keep on going. 
<sighs> Vance, White, uh, there, there's a lot of you guys, I know, and I apologize for missing anyone in particular, but this is absolutely a human experience that we're all living, and for me, next year is gonna be how much can I contribute to this world? I'm gonna start here on YouTube, so yeah. Follow me on Instagram, get me on Facebook, the group, go ahead and join. We're gonna be doing a lot more with the Facebook group um, coming up really, really soon. In the meantime, tomorrow on New Year's Day, um, this lens that I just rented, it's only $6,000 lens, um, but you rent it for $285 for three days. So not bad at all. The Sugar Bowl football game and all of the private events I've been commissioned to work with a buddy of mine. And uh, hopefully I'll have some behind the scenes footage for you, but the Sugar Bowl is very, very picky on, they own the rights to everything. As soon as I squeeze the shutter button, they own it. So I can't really show anything off, including game images, which really stinks. Yeah, maybe I can show you back of camera. Maybe that'll work. Anyway, you guys be safe on New Year's Eve. I can't wait to show you the fireworks show that we have planned for tonight. And most importantly, 2020 is here. A new decade, new change. Come on, man. Let's do this thing together. I'm so glad you're here. All right, GK out. See y'all next year. Peace. We did it already.